Hello, hello, hello. Welcome everyone. Philippe here. Nice to have you guys with me here live. Just opening this random live events that we do. Okay, guys, today we have a theme. I just created a team for this live meeting. And my goal today is to create very, 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 very realistic images by using me journey. Okay, so let's do this right now. Okay, so I have this uh, my me journey prompt, right? This is where, where I, I use my images. So I have this this thing here called uh, Discord. This is where I generate my images, and here you can see many sketchy images that I have done. Here you can see some others, and here we have a little more realistic pictures. We don't can call that realistic, but it's a little bit more realistic here something else more realistic something else here but let's try to find some options to make that even more realistic okay so i will try to create here we can see some others right this is a prompt that we can copy here so let's try to make a living room right realistic so I want to create a let's say a modern living room then I will in minimalistic style concrete walls then of course sketch we don't want to and plants distributed in some parts of the image realistic natural um, let's bring a atmospheric lighting natural colors 4k and this is the proportion right we will we will keep this as a wide image and okay plants distributed in some part of the image what we could do to improve that even more right i could add a background usually I bring the background of a forest so I want to bring lots of nature in, the, in this picture and minimalistic style concrete walls big uh, when I, I call big windows usually because when I say glazing sometimes the, the software don't understand that we are talking about architectural glazings so big windows plants distributed in some parts of the image background of a forest atmospheric lighting natural colors and this will be my prompt okay so while it's processing I have another idea usually I bring some variations of that to see what I can bring better than this so a modern living room in minimalistic style concrete walls in background a realistic uh, we could we could bring volumetric light volumetric lighting maybe we could bring something else usually i like architecture with I will try to bring here um, front view. I can try to bring this uh, in one point of view, right? So I just want to have a one point of view perspective. I want to look that and this just one point of view when we are using perspective. So one point of view. We can bring something also as rule of thirds. So rule of thirds to have this very, you know, harmonic image, just as great people that take pictures. 
and let's take a look on that as well. So the first prompts are already done. And here we can see, I think you are, we already got something good. Maybe not that realistic, but good. I just brought that, that first here. This was the one that I preferred. And let's take a look on that. So this is the picture that we have done. Okay, yeah, uh, it didn't understand the, the concrete, as we can see, concrete walls. It brought a wood, a wood wall, but I enjoy that. Maybe we can bring wood walls for the next ones. So let's see. Yeah, here the, you got the, the concrete idea, right? So here we can see the concrete wall, right? Not that sustainable concrete. Let's bring wood since we are at your green here, your green channel. So let's do that again with a wood. So wood walls, and then we can redo that again. But I enjoy the reality of this picture here. I enjoy that. So I will see another one. Let's see a biggest one of that. I enjoy this picture as well. Let's see the prompt with the rule of thirds. Oh yeah, this one here, we got, we got the rule of thirds. Usually the rule of thirds is the idea that we can find some something is strong in this parts of the drawing here. I don't think it's really applying that. Sammy is leaving. Bye, Sammy. Bye. So here we can see, right, some pictures. Now I can try to bring something different here in my, okay, this was created with wood walls. I truly enjoyed all these pictures. I think the last one I did enjoy too much. Let's see this here. Very nice, right? The amount of plants that we got here, of course, very difficult maintenance, but very cool pictures we have already here. Let's see some others. Let's see this one. Enjoy the textures. I don't think this is too real. I will try to bring something here, a different idea, okay? Just one second, I will get my chat GPT and let's make ChatGPT think with me as well. So here we have uh, some possibilities with ChatGPT. We, I'm using this prompt here called AI RPM. And here we have some mid-journey prompt generators. Let's see if we have some others. Mid-journey. Okay, yeah, so we have many different prompt generators, different styles, okay. Let's bring that, that generator here and let's use the possibility of a modern living room with wood walls. Let's try to bring a realistic and modern living room. And let's see what it, it will bring. While it's bringing, I will add this again because I think I, I, since I put a realistic here at the beginning, maybe Mid Journey will prioritize. So prioritize the reality of the image. So if I bring in that first, right? So I will try to bring that. Let's see. Then I can go back here to my Mid Journey prompt. So. Midjourney brought some prompts for us, uh, ChatGPT brought some prompts for us here, and I will try to use this. Okay, so blindly, I will just add this, and I will copy this to my, my notes here, and I'm going to add this to my Midjourney, and let's see what is going to process. So I'm just adding all the four prompts that we got. Let's see, let's see. So while it's processing, we can take a look on the, pro the, the prompts that are being created. Here is the, the prompts that I have created, that what I called a realistic, right? So realistic and modern living room in minimalistic style with the forest in the background. Let me try to do something here. 
uh, natural. Uh, I will bring something different with this one. You can see that I'm, you know, I'm doing many things at the same time while some things are processing because I don't have patience to to keep waiting for all the prompts. So I want to bring some other ideas and see what we can do. So I will create here a instead of natural colors, I will bring natural calm and soft colors this was an idea of gabriella gabriella is here yet right gabriella right. you you brought this idea of natural soft soft common soft colors in one prompt and i enjoy that so let's see what is going to do with that and also i had other things to to add i would try to uh, I will try to bring some realistic shadows as well. So have more volume. Maybe we can increase the reality of the picture. Okay. So while it's processing this, let's go back to the Mid Journey pro uh, the the ChatGPT prompts that I have asked. So here we can see this biggest prompts. It's more complex. The prompts there that GPT ChatGPT brought us. And I think ChatGPT have GPT has done a very good job of that. Let's see. So here we can we can understand a serene and mortar living room with wood paneled walls, floor to ceiling windows overlooking a lush forest, soft natural filtering through through the leaves. So we have some yeah we have some some shadows from the leaves. We can see a minimalistic furniture, neutral tones, strategically placed potted plants, adding a touch of greenery. So it improved what I have written in a more raw way, right? So, okay. Photography using a wide angle lens. So it brought this idea of a wide angle lens as well. So very nice. Very nice. I don't think it really improved what I have done before because I think I, I, I done a, a good job alone. But here we can see other prompts. Let's see. So here is in a more, more cold colors. So very nice, right? This, this one here and this one here. Everything is great in my opinion. This, it seems more artificial to me, but I enjoyed it a lot. Let's see this too and here we have something with more sun right maybe we could bring more sun rays with that this is too nice it's a more happier uh feel right a happier feel let me try to sometimes i like to bring this so we could create a sun rays and i will try to to bring another and I will, I will call this God rays because God rays are stronger than sun rays and we are going to see that it, it will bring more uh, you know uh, a fantastic appeal on the picture so okay so we were seeing this let's see this ones here okay we have that very nice I enjoy that a lot as well. And you can see that Me Journey, this version 5, is it's very, you know, on the first versions of we were using Me Journey since version 3, and it wasn't that, uh, you know, it was bringing some crazy things that weren't real. Now it's very much more, it's much more real. And very nice. I enjoyed that. I enjoyed this this pattern here on that picture. I enjoyed that as well. Let me reduce myself a little bit so you can see a little bit more about it. Okay, very cool. And this was what we saw. And this was the pictures that we were talking about. Let me bring the best of this. I think this, this two here is nice. And here I brought this idea of calm and soft colors. This is was, was a prompt that I created without ChatGPT. So I think now, uh, yeah, 
chat GPT, GPT prompt is winning us. So my prompt was overcome by chat GPT by now. And here we can see some others. Right, this was created by chat GPT. These other as well. And here we have, here I brought the sun rays on that picture. So this was the chat GPT prompt and I brought the sun rays. So you can see, and I brought some shadows as well, right? Let me see some. No, I think just the sun rays I brought here, right? So here we can see this. Very cool, the tone of this second one here, bringing more dark into, the, into this. Here we have this with the God rays. Very nice light intensity here, right? Light intensity here as well, very cool. We could bring, maybe bring this as another idea and bring a possibility of a golden hour. Okay, let's see this in golden hour, in a golden hour prompt. Okay, so very cool. I enjoy a lot this. Uh, let me bring this. And the third one to see. And here is the, the thing that, that I have created before, right, with ChatGPT. I enjoy that. This one with the texture, now in a better resolution. Here we can see this one with the strong shadows that I have done before. So very nice. I like this. It's more dramatic. I, I enjoy these dramatic pictures. And here we can see with the god rays. Very cool, right? The the space, the the size of the space. Here we can see the shadows, right? Fantastic. bringing very realistic shadows from the, the glazing. You can see here something that really makes sense. So let's see this other one here. More golden hour. And this was what this, the ones that I created with this golden hour settings. So very, very, very cool. Maybe just for it for us to test something, we could bring us a drone, a bird's eye view of a contemporary. Let's try to bring something more, you know, on top of that. Let's see if it's going to process. But this is it, guys. So I just created this event here to talk about. This video is related to Mid Journey, the prompts that we can create. And my goal here was to bring something realistic. I think we got fantastic possibilities here. And you can do the same to bring this more realistic ideas for your project. So, of course, bring that to, to real life and use that as an, an inspiration. Of course, in the future, I think we will have the possibilities to create real architectural prompts and use that in a better way. But here we can see, okay, this is the bird's eyes view that I asked. So very nice, but I enjoy more these pictures here. Okay, guys, so thank you for watching this video here and keep watching our channel. Press like, subscribe to our channel because we are bringing fantastic contents every day related to the world of architecture, AI, sustainable design, and much more. So thank you for joining this video here, okay? Now let's take a look in something else. I want to record my voice and let's see, and I will create a clone of my own voice. So what I'm going to use for that, 11 laps, 
okay? So this is a software that we can use for voice cloning. I already have this account and I already have my voice, but I just have my voice in Portuguese language. So I want to create a my clone in English language and see what we can do, okay? So I will go to this speech synthesis. This is the thing that, oh, I'm sorry, voice lab. And here I can create my voice okay so voice cloning right i can get my voice here so let's say philips english voice and then i will just uh record here something so i will use audacity right audacity is the software here let's let me bring that to you here is audacity right so i will start recording my voice my name is philip hello you guys when i speak english i speak slightly different than portuguese when i speak portuguese i speak more like this uh this is my voice in portuguese language i'm you know i'm a bolder guy in portuguese but i can't do this in english and i don't know why so here is my voice in english in english and I need to make some expressions to so me, the the software the Eleven Labs can really have me in a more you know distinct way. So I will laugh here. Ha 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 ha! Hey, hello everyone! Hello everyone! Excited voice. Hey, how are you guys? This is Philip. Hello, 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 hello. Okay, this is my voice. I will record a minute or something. Gabriella think that I'm crazy here maybe, but I will keep going. So this is my voice, okay? I have the, my voice here. I will save the project, export this as an MP3 file, and I will get, so, Philip English voice, save that to my computer, and now I can upload this. So I will upload my voice. Philip, English voice. Let me try to find Philip, English voice. And okay, it's, it's asking to bring more voices. Okay, so I will bring a voice from, I don't want to speak five minutes here, so I will bring another voice from a video that I have here, just one second. I will bring this voices from a video. So I will, bye Gabriella. So I will open here my video editor and I will capture a voice from a video. Just one second. So here I have some recordings that I have done and I will upload that in English and just capture the voices. And I will export as an audio file, audio only, audio MP3, and I will export this. Philip to English. And I will save this, I will export this to get a bigger file to upload here, right? So, two minutes to go. Since we are transmitting that on video and processing video here, the audio it's it takes a longer time so let's wait a minute
Okay, so now I have this. I will Okay, so now I have this and the software said I need to add less than 10 megabytes. So I will remove that and export this on Audacity. Okay, so now I have all the files. I can confirm and add my voice here. Actually, I didn't need five minutes. But let's try to create something here, okay? So I will get a prompt, a prompt from ChatGPT here to see how it goes. Cloned English voice. Here we have some settings, right? We have the stability and the clarity. Usually, I like to bring the clarity as a hundred percent and the uh, stability around 50 percent because I can bring a more nuance to the voice. My voice will uh, have more musicality because if I bring a hundred percent here, it will be more robot like. So, I want to increase keep the the as 50 percent because I don't have too much expression in my voice and people usually have more than me. So 50% is good and similarity enhancement is this. So keep the keep the, the, the similarity of my voice as precise as possible. So let's generate this. Maybe I could bring another prompt, right? Uh, let me just um, get a let me bring something from Wikipedia, right? Something that we have in English. It's generating. Wikipedia is hosted by the Wikimedia Foundation, a nonprofit organization that also hosts a range of other projects. So this is me cloned, right? What do you think, guys? It's similar or not? Wikipedia is hosted by the Wikimedia Foundation, a nonprofit organization that also hosts a range of other projects. I don't know if that's too similar. Maybe I could just bring that a little more. Musicality, let's try it again. Wikipedia is hosted by the Wikimedia Foundation, a nonprofit organization that also hosts a range of other projects. Yeah, it, it brought more musicality. So this is me, guys. This is my voice. So it's possible to clone 
you know any person's voice it's possible to make this use by using the software and in my opinion i don't i don't have any relationship with level labs but i think this is the best software that we have to clone voice at an affordable price today okay so take a look on eleven labs it's very easy to use as we were talking so eleven labs has this possibility to create this voice lab create voices patterns then you go here and you add this and you can use even other languages usually monolingual will be you have better results because it's uh right the native processing of the the software but you can use multilingual and it works it's not that good but it works very well as well so this is my history you can see here my my prompt of that so thank you for joining thank you for joining see you in the next video about ai all right guys so this is the second uh section that i wanted to bring here and we have some other things that i wanted to to show here in the in this live event here quickly because i need to go home because my kids are waiting okay so Okay, guys, now I want to test some great ideas here related to Mid Journey, right? We are always testing some ideas here of the software. And today I want to, to, to test this possibility to create this blend images. So what is blend? Is to mix one picture with another and bring a different result, right? So, for example, you can bring a person's face with another person's face and create a merge of these two possibilities so we were creating the in the last video that we have done some pictures related to photorealistic images we tried to bring our best here with some prompts and you should take a look on that video to see that and here i will show you so i will save these images that i have done in a folder here right and i will save some others i will save this one here right so we can bring a possibility of mixing these two right with the blend modes i will have some others i will get some others and let's see the results that we can get so let's let me bring you something yeah this will be something curious then I can just go to Mid Journey and type blend space, and I can find these two pictures that I wanted. Right, the first picture and the second picture. And now I have these two pictures, and I can just process this and click enter. So it's going to blend these two images and create just one and this is something nice because you can 
you know, bring the maybe the best of these two options and, you know, create something entirely new. I didn't bring the the prompt the, the entire prompt. Maybe we could just bring the entire idea of the first of one of these prompts, maybe the just the resolution we could bring and create this bland possibilities. So I will just do that again. I will add two more pictures because it, it will not show the correct resolution that I wanted. And I want to get these pictures with the plants and this more dramatic picture that I have here. Let's see if it's going to, to create what we really want here, okay? So let's see. Let's do the blending between these two images. And here you can see the blended image of these two ideas. So we can see that it really got two things of these two images. So we can see the plants that we have on that picture here, on this, this one here, what it is, this here. So we brought some plants. And we brought something of the other image as well, right? This image that we were seeing here, right? So almost the same scene, but with the plants and things like that. But I didn't like the resolution. And it's not bringing the, the resolution that I wanted in these two pictures here. But here we can see some results, right? So bringing the dramaticity of the shadows of the first picture and the other. So these are, we can find many different possibilities when you do something like it. So we, we you could blend, for example, let's get Mickey Mouse and let's bring a picture of Mickey Mouse. So I will copy the image here. So I'm copying Mickey Mouse and Arnold Schwarzenegger. Okay, let's see what we can get by copying Arnold Schwarzenegger and Mickey Mouse and blend these two guys. Just finding here these two characters. And now I will merge that. So I will get Arnold Schwarzenegger and Mickey Mouse and let's see what Midjourney can do for us related to that. So I'm just playing here, but you can do this, of course, with architectural uh, projects. And you can, for example, have a sketch. Let's say you have a, a architectural sketch as well. Architectural sketch. And I will bring just a random architectural sketch that I will I found on the internet. So I'm I will bring this I'm just copying here something, okay? So copy image. Here we can see, right, the Mickey Mouse with Arnold Schwarzenegger in just one picture. Look how great it is. Fantastic, right? So a strong guy with a funny face or something. So it's the blending mode of Mid Journey. This is a possibility that, that you can use. And now let's take a look in, in something else, right? Let's just add the blend mode again. And I will add a sketch. Let me find this sketch image that I have here. Just one second. So here is a sketch and I will add the, these colors of this living room, right? And let's see what we, what it can brings us. The results are, are, harder to control when you, when you are using these possibilities on Mid Journey, but I think it's nice to to have this, to watch this and understand the, the concept of the blending mode of Mid Journey. 
So let's see, let's see. Okay, so now we have the remix between these two images, right? The sketch and the actual realistic living room that we have done before. So it created something here different, right? So these are possibilities that you can bring in your mid journey, right? So uh, I wanted to bring these possibilities for you. Maybe you can help in your architectural sketches or maybe your different types of designs. And I hope you have enjoyed this video don't forget guys subscribe to our channel and press like to support this channel to grow because we are trying to bring the best content of all for everyone here okay so thank you so much Okay, guys, just one second. I will just go back in, in, the, in one minute, okay? Guys, this is it for today. Thank you for watching this video. I will keep going. I have to put my family to sleep, okay? My kids have a dinner and everyone is asleep. So thank you so much for joining this video and we see you in the next one. Bye-bye.